Good afternoon. So today I'm going to uh, explain you how to make a description for X-rays. That's an X-ray anchor joint. So first of all, we should have straight uh, AP and lateral view. This is AP view. We can estimate the position of the mortise medial and lateral malleolus. And on this view, we can see the possible dislocations or subluxations of the talus bone. On the lateral view, we can see the fractures of posterior malleolus, if present, lateral malleolus. And uh, we can uh, find uh, dislocation of the foot to the posterior or to the anterior side. So first of all, we uh, should check uh, and find possible fractures. So we are going along the cortical layer and we have a disruption of this cortical layer. We can see the fracture. So here we can find a fracture of medial malleolus. And we have a gap between bone fragments, which indicates that there's some displacement of medial malleolus. So we have a fracture of medial malleolus with displacement. So let's go along the fibula. As we see, there's a contour of fibula and there are some fracture lines like here that indicates the fracture with some displacement. Next thing that we should check, we should check the position of the talus bone. We are checking the medial space, medial clear space and lateral clear space, and so-called verba circle, to check the length of the fibula. As well, we can see that the talus is shifted to the lateral side. If to compare with the contour of the medial malleolus. And this shift indicates the subluxation of talus. So on this AP view, we can see that there is a fracture of medial malleolus and lateral malleolus with subluxation of talus bone to the lateral side. Now let's go to the lateral view. Here we can see some other interesting facts. Actually, we should check the joint surface and we see the posterior part and we see that the talus is dislocated to the posterior part. As well as that, we have a displacement here. So we have a displaced posterior edge fracture with subluxation of the foot to the posterior side. So now if to summarize, we have a three malleolar fracture, malleolus, medial malleolus, lateral malleolus, posterior edge of tibia with subluxation of the foot to the lateral side and to the posterior side. That is your diagnosis. Thank you very much.